I'm Peter Kornblu and I direct the Cuba Documentation Project in the National Security Archive. The normalization of diplomatic relations between the United States and Cuba means the opening of Cuba to much more travel, to see what you and I are seeing. And of course the cars of Cuba are a huge cultural, social and economic attraction. We have a moving museum of Americana here in Havana and across the island. American cars from the 1940s and 50s, some of them in pristine condition and delightful to watch as they drive up and down the streets and really extraordinary to actually be in. This is the one place in the world where these cars are still on the road and mass. Many, many, many of them. The 56 and 57 Bel Airs, the Fords from the 1940s, even some of the Model Ts are still running around the streets of Havana. We are sitting at the Hotel Nacional on the patio. As you can tell from the hustle and bustle and the noise of construction and refurbishing behind me, they are beautifying this hotel patio in preparation for the visit of the Secretary of State John Kerry. He will be the highest U.S. official to come to Cuba since the 1959 revolution. My father trained auto workers at the UAW and I grew up uh, in Detroit and Ann Arbor. So I've always been around uh, American cars, always loved American cars. And, and the idea that cars can be a bridge between the Cuban society and American society uh, and that U.S. citizens will come to Cuba and, and experience the extraordinary phenomena of these American cars still on the road here really excites me. Change is going to accelerate in Cuba and Cuba is going to move from a communist system to a much more capitalist oriented system and the cars are going to be part of that. The cars are going to be the main tourist attraction for U.S. citizens. The entrepreneurial spirit and building these taxi fleets of these old cars and new cars is coming to Cuba. The private sector in many ways will be focused on the car uh, service industry, transportation, rental cars, taxis, chauffeur driven cars. People will come down here in part for the travel experience and these beautiful old cars and new cars are going to be part of their adventures in Cuba.